his delivery stride. And the first two meters of ball flight is all the time he has got to take to judge line, to judge length, to judge speed, to judge swing, and to judge bounce before he makes a decision on what shot to play and whether to play in the correct place to get a gap and score some runs. So a batsman like A.B. De Villiers has less than half a second to make up his mind and react. He can either defend, attack or leave. And if it's aimed at his chin, he better duck and duck fast. So in that moment of truth, what goes on in his mind? Does fear overcome skill? You, you can't afford to play with the fear of, of actually getting hurt or fear of failure. Um, the minute you cross the boundary, you realise the guy's quick. Um, it's, it's a big mental thing. You've got you've to just overcome the fear of, OK, this guy's actually fast. If I do miss it, I might actually break a rib. <laughs> once, you, once you overcome that, and that's always been a, been a part of my game from a, from a young age, you always, as a youngster, feel like, oh, but this guy's fast. Am I going to get hit? I mean, if I miss the pool shot, he's going to hit me on my helmet. What, what can happen? That's something you gotta, you just got to work at and, and, and learn to do um, throughout your career. The other thing is to wait for a ball. Um, no matter how fast he is, you got to allow your brain, like I said before, to, to read what's happening. Um, so that's, those are the two things I'll, I'll just focus on. Really give it a split second to actually come so that you give yourself the best opportunity to play the right line, to, to see the right length, etc. It even takes a lot out of one of the world's best batsmen to react at such high speeds. And it all begins at a very young age. But how does one even hone something as natural as reflexes and make them faster? There's a good stroke. Quickly into position. Gave it all he had. So that when the time comes, a split second can seem like an eternity, at least to those watching from a distance. I wish I could get all the people in India and 